is it back to bed? Probably. Huh? Or uh, on to that uh, fabulous open air market in the center of Vientiane where all the dirt roads uh, come together in the circle there next to the Viet Cong embassy. Uh, oh, the goddess fancies a still. Great. Uh, so we bid adieu to Opium Dragon and the Mekong Spinner Dolphin. She fucks like a dolphin, too, with a one-and-a-half twist, sometimes uh, uh, right off the bed onto the dock. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. We mander, uh, 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 wander along the dirt roads. Uh, to sustain, we have one, one goal here for today, to sustain our bubble, our buzz, our effervescent buzz bubble of our marijuana high. So uh, we're protecting that as we walk toward the open market. Oh, open market, oh yeah, we're amazed. There's a, like about a dozen old ladies squatting on their haunches selling stalks of pure Marijuana. <laughs> now that we need the score, uh, it's just the buzz. I mean, publicly selling marijuana in the open comment marketplace uh, makes us laugh uh, about this commonplace legal vibration, which in comparison, Western civilizations, uh, they come off as a, a kind of a dumb, creepy uh, conspiracy against anything exotic. Exotic, deflate that, smother that, exotic, fun. Ever heard of the natural spices of life, folks? Uh, Open market, oh, it's open. Ooh, baskets of live squirming eels. And well, that's a, like a mountain of red chili peppers, but uh, on the pot, hang on, they're so shiny. Red, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, but look, uh, uh, Rainbow and I, we're not tourists at heart anymore. We've seen so many fantasy countries and their bazaars that uh, uh, we simply uh, walk across the street <laughs> past the Viet Cong embassy <laughs> yeah, into a European delicatessen where we score. I'm talking Australian butter from the outback formage. Uh, like, uh, let's get a, a little camembert, French cheese, um, a baguette, another baguette, one baguette begets another baguette, <laughs> sniff that, mm. get down on that, and then, <laughs> ah, eat it up, oh yeah, okay, oh. Well, outside that uh, little deli, oh, there's a French vendor. He's uh, actually slicing up fresh pineapples into uh, circular slices. Yeah, we'll take some of that in a little plastic bag. I mean, if they're just Southeast Asia, everything's in a little plastic bag, okay? They love them so much. I uh, got some, oh, why, we we shouldn't have ate it like in the street because we, it, 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 we, we, it's sloppy and we just slop. Yeah, I have a pineapple all over us, and our clothes aren't that clean to start with. So anyway, what a messy rush. But from all those bongs with, with opium drinking, we are just so <laughs> kind of crazy to get some. Mm. Good. Okay. Um, what do we do for the rest of the day? Okay, we, we, we make it back to the bungalow, and uh, we smoke pot. That's what we do. Uh-huh. Eat. And, um, uh, <laughs> fuck away. 
the rest of the day, yeah. And, you know, tonight is special because the spinner dolphin of the Mekong, that Swiss check, that panders to the uh, American killers up here. Uh, she's invited us to her favorite opium den. It's a little shack in a creepy old French cemetery somewhere. You know, where you're free to smoke heroin and opium. And, you know, they love freaks in there. They love the hippies. And uh, you get some dropouts from the Lao Air Force <laughs> hanging out there. Uh, we hear. Uh. So, uh, opium den? Goddess Earth, you might want to inhabit uh, a rainbow's body just about now so you can also smoke opium. You know, another another new trip on Earth for you. So, like, kind of get in now before we head on out at night beyond our king-size bed. Is this risky behavior? <laughs> <laughs> 